Hi, this is an overview of the License Manager for the Coming Soon plugin. We've built the License Manager to help you, to make your life easier. If you're a webmaster, an agency, or anybody who handles a lot of websites, you know that managing license keys can be a real burden. You need a fast, secure way of making sure that nobody is using your licenses and that your clients don't have any problems with them. This is exactly what you'll be able to do with our license manager. Let's have a look. The dashboard contains an overview of your purchases, licenses and sites and it will soon contain a bunch of instructional videos regarding the license manager. Now moving on to purchases. Most of our clients will have only one purchase. This is a great way and place to check if you actually got what you paid for, when did you buy it, what's the status of your purchase, do you have unlimited number of sites, is it a forever license and which one of the extra features do you have. For those purchasing the LTD license, obviously you have an unlimited sites, valid forever and all of the extra features. Now moving on to licenses. Everything's pretty much standard as you thought it would be. However, there's a twist. We have regular license keys and we have domain license keys. Let me show you what those are. So when you create a new license, you can create a regular, normal, the way you're used to license key, which you enter on the client site. However, you can also create a domain license key. That means that when you create a license, you enter the site's URL and that's it. When you're on the client site, you don't have to enter anything. You just click activate license and we just link that site to this license. We know the URL and magic happens. That's it. It's very handy. And the best thing is you can only use it on that site. So even if the client would share a license, which he can't, nothing will happen. If you choose the regular license key, then you can choose how many sites it's active on. You can choose the date it's valid until, as well as the purchase it will be linked to. There's a note that's just for you. Nobody else can read it and the extra features. Once you click create, the new license is saved and ready to use. As you can see here, some licenses are regular license keys and some of them are for just the domain. We do not count local hosts toward your max sites count. However, you will see them and you will see the number of active sites per license and the number of max sites that you can have on license that you can set on your own. Moving on to sites. Here's the list of sites that I have on my licenses, as well as one site that is currently blocked. You can also see some details about each site. If it's a local host, what's the title, what's the WordPress version, plugin version, the license key that's used, the date it was added and the last time the license was checked on that site. That's it. If you have any questions, please let us know. Thank you.